Um. Well then. Wasn't expecting that. Look at that bug. This game was like, no, you don't get a break. We're just gonna punch the shit out of you with this guy now. Hey, look, a pro. <laughs> Whoa. A crow just dive bombs you. He's going down! We're yelling timber. Oh god, no. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> what? No! <laughs> <laughs> I thought you liked Better that song. move, we came to dance. No, I don't like that song. <laughs> <laughs> Not a fan of that music. <laughs> I do like some Kesha songs though, but not that one. <laughs> Welcome to Castlefront Village. You must be the Corgi that defeated the Bat Queen. Can you teach me a few of those awesome spells? Nope, sorry. You gotta pay for that shit. The Blob King keeps kidnapping our children. Please save them. No. <laughs> Shut up, Pig J. Hey, look, a new spell. Maya studies the spell of Corgi Healing. Unlike the Healing Light Aura, it is an instant and powerful heal, but with a long cooldown, it will also slightly heal teammates. You can't afford that stuff, you're too poor. You're too porgy. Oh, whoa. Magus Kitty? That looks awesome. Fuck up this magic cat. I am Magus Kitty, destroyer of realms, ruiner of lives, person who shoots tiny fireballs out of my very large hands, and sometimes skulls. Oh, that went the entire opposite direction of which I wanted it to go. You were getting your bug hits. Might be time to turn on the healing light. Nope, you're dead. Try again! You can defeat Magus Kitty. Okay, I need to stop casting the magic light when I don't want to. Also, why does Corgi Power do almost nothing to the Warlock Man? Maybe because he's also a Warlock Man-ness. Try the lightning! Take Good, my lightning, fucker! Well, that worked out well. <laughs> you know, taking every single one of his hits is a good way to fight him, too. Yep. 10 out of 10. That's how I'd fight him. <laughs> it was like a stampede. <laughs> Doggo stampede. 10 out of 10. Why do I not have an ice spell yet? Because you don't. It was very good for freezing fireballs. I said it would even do that in this game. Or if there's even an ice spell at all. I think you just need to get better at dodging his attack pattern. Um, you missed. Yeah, the controller likes to have me turn the opposite direction of what I like to face sometimes. Man, this is like the thing that's fucked you up way more than anything else so far in this game. Taste my corgis! You can't handle this much corgi power. Who knew a cat would have been the dog's only weakness? What a twist! I don't know if it helps you any, but it always shoots fireball, skull fireball. Don't worry, you got this. You got this. It's all you, bud. You're already pretty close, actually. Oh no! Oh god. Stop jumping right into his attacks! <laughs> Maybe you should stop throwing attacks where I'm jumping. <laughs> you were doing so well, you almost beat him that time. Why is Wizard Cat so much of an issue? Magus Kitty, show him some respect. No! <laughs> Not until he does it dead. <laughs> he is the greatest of all Magus Kitties. You know, whenever we finish this, all I have to do is get Raw to finish a portal and I will have everything I need to make videos for this week. Except for time. 
because I'll be working all week, so maybe I'll have time to actually make the videos. Oh God, oh. stop! I guess that's not true, anyways, because also the podcast. We'll have to record a new. Oh podcast. my God! <laughs> Didn't you die again? And I was so close. Take that! Why do I have to spam my ultimate attack to do a lot of damage to him? Why don't you use your healing magic? Because I forget I have it. Mm. That explains a lot. That explains everything. Oh, maybe we shouldn't get right up on him. Seems like a bad idea. Oh, that totally works. Getting in people's faces doesn't totally make them super aggressive at you. I've seen it move. You didn't cast your healing magic. Hey, you got him. Fuck you, you man. You defeated the Magus Kitty, but there are darker and more terrible evils inside of this castle. Shut up, pig. Oh no, there's a lot of horsies. Oh my god, stop. Wow, you're getting just wrecked at every possible turn. Well then, that couldn't have possibly gone worse. Well done defeating Magus Kitty, but this level is just as fucking hard. You might die again. Oh my god, why? Um, well, Ripperone, as some people would tell me. Watching all these people just destroy you is always fun. Oh no! What are you doing? I'm trying to jump into my lightning charges. Now for the ceremonial thing that I've done in every single one of the Let's Plays that I've that you've been in. <laughs> every single one so far, I've opened a can of something. Rip everyone's ears. It's not usually that loud, actually. It just sounds like a can being oh opened. <laughs> Probably because it is a can being opened. <laughs> So we're at 50 so minutes of recording, so I'm gonna say once you actually make it to the end of this level, we can, <laughs> if we ever do, we can call this, uh, call this the end. Oh my god. Uh, you are dead. You are so dead. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> You've seen, you've seen this, like a hundred times and it still catches you off guard every time there's It's a not that it catches me off guard, it's that there's 20 enemies there. Yeah, that's what you have lightning for. <laughs> it only kills the 10 of them that are on my screen at the time. And really, the enemies coming at me from behind is completely unneeded when there's 20 in front of me. You should probably heal yourself, by the way. Hooray! Get the ones behind you! Okay, so do you want my suggestion once you get through this little section here? Alright, stop. Up oh, too late now. Kill this guy and then stop. Alright. Now hang out here for a second. Kill that guy, obviously. And kill those guys. And then just wait on your heal power to recharge and heal yourself again. But the enemies are constantly spawning, so I have to also constantly kill them. Yeah, but they spawn behind you. The ones that in front in front of you don't trigger till you actually go over there. So as long as you just keep dealing with the ones that are behind you, you can let your thing charge and then heal. And it doesn't matter lickety splits at all to me because if you sit here forever, I can just cut to whenever you're not sitting here anymore. So it's not gonna bother anyone. Hey, look a dragon. Shooting fireballs, shooting fireballs, shooting them behind me to kill bunnies and sheep. There we go, this is going a lot better already. Uh oh, jump over him and try to get behind him. Oop, did that not work? Nope. Oh, shit, heal. Too late. How are you supposed to... I have to corgi power him to death. Huh. 
<laughs> so you can't get behind him or anything, huh? Nope. <laughs> oh, a dick move. So the question is how to get past the sheep. Maybe you have to hit him whenever he's throwing the, the uh, spears or something. Heal yourself. Maybe shoot him some more. I think it is hurting him, it's just not hurting him a lot. Yeah. Okay, so you just have to keep well hit him with the lightning. Yeah, see it's doing damage, it's just not doing a lot of damage. Alright, and then look behind you. You might want to check behind you before somebody sneaks up on you and kills you again. Also heal. Hooray! Now go run to the end. We might have finally done it. You might have finally survived. Yeah, then we get fucked up by another sheep man with a shield. We might have finally survived. Oh, hey, look. Money. A big old bag of muns. I do love big old bags of muns. Woo! Let's get out of this place. Let's get the heck out of here. All right. Press that sweet, sweet stir button. Hey, look. All right. So, this has been the Respaw Gaming. I am the Blake Fox. And I fucking hate how difficult this game is. And we will see you at some point in the future when we record more video. Yeah. Bye! Corganado.